So now we're going to look at how to subtract on a number line. So the question we have here is 10 minus 3. I have a line of 10 here, and because we're going to be taking away, let's break up that line of 10 into 10 units. So we're starting with 10, so I'm going on the, my number line to put the counter on 10. So I need to subtract 3. So if I take away 1, you can see I've jumped back 1 on my number line. But that's minus 1, so we need to take away another. So I've jumped back again. And 1 more means we've taken away 3, so we've jumped back again. So I've made 3 jumps back on my number line, and I've landed on the number 7. And you can see that my number line has given me the answer here, because if I count up how many blocks I have left, I've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So 10 take away 3 is 7. Now let's look at 16 minus 4. So I'm going to start on 16, and what am I going to do now? Well, I'm going to make four jumps back because I'm taking away four. So let's jump back one, two, three, four. And you can see that I've landed on the number 12. So 16 minus four is 12. Now let's look at another question. We've got 14 minus six. So now pause the video and see if you can tell me the answer to 14 minus 6 using the number line to help you. So we start on 14 and we jump back 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Now I can see that I have landed on the number 8. So 14 take away 6 gives me 8. Now let's have a look at 15 minus 8. So I'm going to start on my number line with 15. And then how many jumps back am I going to make? Well, I'm subtracting 8, so let's make 8 jumps back. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. I've landed on the number 7, so 15 minus 8 is 7. Now pause the video and have a think and see if you can explain. How is subtracting on a number line different from adding on a number line? Well, so far with subtraction, we've been going backwards rather than forwards. And we've always started with the first number in our subtraction. So we started with 15 and went back 8. We don't start with 8 and try and go back 15. Whereas with addition, it doesn't matter which number you start with. Now, there are different ways of subtracting on a number line, which we'll learn in a different video. But the two things we need to remember for now are that we start on the first number and we jump backwards by the number that we're taking away. So now let's look at another question. 13 take away 9. So we start on 13, and we're going to make 9 jumps back. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. We've landed on the number 4, so there's our answer.